This man was trapped underwater for 72 hours, and you won't believe what happened to him. It's 5 o'clock in the morning on May 26, 2013, when Harrison O'Keen finds himself trapped in the bathroom of a sinking ship. It's the Jackson 4, a Nigerian tugboat where he is a crew member, but suddenly Harrison feels the weight of the boat shift downward. The bathroom then quickly begins to fill up with water, and Harrison races to escape, but he's unable to pull open the emergency hatch. He then uses his bare hands to bash open the bathroom door and climbs through, just in time to see three of his crew members fall off the side of the ship and plunge into the Atlantic Ocean. But just when he thought he'd made it to safety, the boat starts sinking into the icy water, so Harrison rushes toward the cabin, but finds himself trapped inside a tiny air pocket. This 4 foot by 4 foot space will remain his only source of oxygen for the next 72 hours as he's trapped 100 feet below the surface of the ocean. Harrison has no idea what's going on and everything around him is pitch black. And while his upper body's warm, his legs are surrounded in freezing water and the only thing he can hear is the sound of sharks tearing apart the bodies of his fellow crewmates. Harrison then asks himself three questions that might never get answered. Am I the sole survivor? How long will this oxygen last me? Is help on the way? But with no phone, no watch, and no sunlight, the man is unable to tell how long he's been trapped underwater. And as the hours tick by, Harrison prays to calm his fears as he's trapped in total darkness with no food and no water, just waiting to be rescued. But at this point, Harrison's blood sugar is getting low. He hasn't had anything to drink, and if he can't find a way to warm up his body, he is going to die because of the cold. And luckily, after searching around the cabin, he comes across a few cans of Diet Coke, which he sips on a little bit at a time, enjoying every last drop. Harrison then discovers a small mattress that he uses to keep his upper body warm, but despite these gifts, the three days of being submerged at the bottom of the ocean cause him to lose hope. That's when he sees a diver's light break through the darkness, and Harrison leaves the air pocket and dives face first into the open ocean. He's spotted by the diver and starts signaling to him, but the man jumps back and shouts, he's alive, he's alive, into his camera. The diver then follows Harrison back into his air pocket and gives him a thumbs up, telling him to stay calm. A few moments later, a rescue crew brings him to safety, just in time before his oxygen runs out. Because of the small size of the air pocket that he was trapped in, at the time he was rescued, Harrison only had two hours of oxygen left. Are you alright Harrison? Are you comfortable? And when he gets to the surface, doctors inform him that the other 11 crew members on the ship had died in the incident, making Harrison the only survivor. If you want more survival stories just like this, hit the notification